Hi, I'm Gabriel Gonzalez, founder of the Academy for Applied Heart Intelligence and Heart and Mind Consulting. Today's meditation is part of a monthly series entitled The Inner Temple of the Heart. These meditations can have a profound effect in your life and in the lives of people around you, especially when practiced together in groups at the time of the full moon. Why the full moon? The subtle energies that are available during this special time invite us to deepen our connection to our inner wisdom, unexpress emotions, and the true desires of our soul. As the warm sun illuminates the cool darkness of the moon, so are all these unexamined aspects of ourselves brought forth into the light, giving us the opportunity to heal, grow, and transform. In our human bodies, our heart is equivalent to our central planetary sun. By bringing our focus attention to the spiritual heart, or the heart behind the heart, we begin to gain access to what our ancestral spiritual traditions refer to as the inner temple of the heart. The Lingong or soul's temple, the shrine inside the castle of Brahman, the jewel inside the lotus flower, the sacred heart of Christ, the heart of the beloved, the Shanta Ishta, the central sun, or the heart of God. This inner temple of your heart is your inner sanctuary and source of love, wisdom, and power, generating the largest electromagnetic energy field of your body. This field expands in all directions, connecting you to all living beings in all dimensions, transcending time and space. It also connects you to the infinite wisdom of your soul, to the universal heart of our Creator, Spirit, or God, and to the Archangelic Realm. By directing our focus attention through heart intentional breathing, we establish a deeper connection with our inner temple of the heart, activating the vibrational frequencies of the 12 virtues of the heart. They are appreciation, compassion, forgiveness, humility, understanding, valor, love, kindness, freedom, truth, harmony, and honor. Today, we're going to focus on activating the virtue of freedom. The word freedom can mean many things to different people. But as a virtue of the heart, freedom is your capacity to choose what you need, want, or desire for your life. And to do so, without the burden of other people's opinions about what is right or wrong for you. Choosing who you want to be, whom you want to love, where you want to go, what you want to say, what you want to do, is an expression of your divine, sovereign right to co-create your life experience with the divine and thus fulfill your highest destiny. Each time that you consciously choose what feels right and is perfect for you, and you do so from a place of love, appreciation, and honor for yourself, others, and all of life. You experience a feeling of expansion in the middle of your chest. That feeling is a universal signal that you are in perfect alignment with your highest self, God's will, and the natural rhythm of life. Like a bird flying in the sky, this inner sense of freedom is your inner guide towards the secret desires of your heart. For the next few minutes, we're going to evoke the feeling or the vibration of freedom within our own hearts, radiating it first to ourselves in the different areas of our lives, and then to our family and friends and to all those beings that we share this beautiful planet with, especially those who are suffering and need it the most. We begin by setting the intention to connect deeply with the vibration or the feeling of freedom within our own hearts for our own benefit, the benefit of those we love, strangers that we've never met, and the evolution of our world. As we bring the awareness, the focus, to our hearts by placing a hand over the middle of our chest as we begin to breathe slowly, deeply, and evenly. Imagining that you have a hole right there in the center of your chest 
so that you are inhaling straight into the heart, making your breath nice and slow. The kind of breathing that you experience when you're fast asleep and when you feel calm and safe. Breathing deeply into the heart and all the way down into the stomach, filling your entire body with every inhalation, exhaling naturally as you begin to create a natural rhythm that is even so that the inhale and the exhale are approximately the same length. With every inhalation, you relax more and more into the present moment. You relax more and more into the power and the wisdom of your own heart. We now activate the vibration of freedom by thinking of something or someone who evokes the feeling of freedom. So as you put on a big smile, can you think of a time in your life when you felt free? When you were being fully yourself and you felt free to express yourself and to make some powerful choices in your life. Or can you think of a person who is an expression of what it means to be fully free? Free of other people's opinions, free of other people's judgments, free of society's ideas of what is right and wrong. Someone who you experience as a fully free being. As you evoke these feelings of freedom, with every inhalation, allow these feelings to expand within your own heart. Activating the vibration of freedom within your own heart. Allowing your chest to open nice and wide. like a bird flying through the sky. The key to this process is that you actually feel the feeling of freedom before you can share it with others, before you can radiate it out. Allow this vibration, this feeling of freedom to expand beyond your heart so that it expands to your arms and your legs and your head. Allowing freedom to fill your entire body. Letting this vibration of freedom to transcend your body as you begin to direct it towards those areas of your life that could benefit from freedom. So can you think of any area of your life where you might be feeling as if you're in a prison, as if you are bound by chains, as if you have to do something against your will? And can you imagine yourself just radiating that feeling of freedom to that being that you are? radiating that vibration of freedom to those areas. Perhaps you want to experience financial freedom. So imagine the vibration of freedom going out into your finances. See yourself as spending money freely, investing in others, giving to others, creating money freely. Perhaps you want to experience greater physical freedom in your body. 
So see yourself walking, running, swimming, performing those activities you love with freedom. Perhaps it's a relationship that feels constricted. So, so for a moment, imagine what it would be like to experience a sense of freedom in that relationship. Freedom to be yourself, to express yourself. Allow this vibration of freedom now to go beyond your life, to now start including your family and your friends. People in your life that you experience as constricted, oppressed, or burdened by their own judgments or other people's judgments. Anybody who could really benefit from this vibration of freedom. Imagine this freedom going out as a wave that penetrates their energetic field and infuses them with the energy of freedom. See them as see them as already free and liberated and rejoice in their freedom which is your freedom. Imagine this vibration of freedom now going beyond your friends and your family and the people that you love to now start including people in your neighborhood, people in your city, in your town where you live. As it begins to expand, covering the entire territory of the country where you live. Transcending all boundaries, including other neighboring countries, as this vibration of freedom begins now to expand throughout the entire planet. Supporting people throughout the entire world who are experiencing extreme distress, hardship, and bondage. also include animals, plants, and all other life forms as you continue to broadcast this vibration, this feeling of freedom throughout the entire planet. As you experience these feelings within your own heart first, You're now strengthening your capacity to experience it any time that you want and to continue to share it with the world. Now, silently or out loud, repeat after me. I am freedom. Freedom flows from me. Freedom returns to me. I am free to choose what I want. Freedom is my sovereign right. I am freedom. Freedom flows from me. Freedom returns to me. I am free to choose what I want. Freedom is my sovereign right. I am freedom. Freedom flows from me. Freedom returns to me. I am free to choose what I want. 
Freedom is my sovereign right. As you continue to breathe slowly, deeply, and evenly in and out of your heart, visualize this freedom as energy that is going out into the world as a coherent wave of energy that is helping to harmonize our world, our planet, our economic, social, and political systems, opening the hearts and minds of our political leaders, encouraging them to pursue policies that benefit us all. Policies that honor our Mother Earth, that honor the sustainability of all of life, including our individual right to freedom, clean water, wholesome foods, shelter, right employment, love and friendship, and fulfilling our life's purpose. Envision people opening their hearts to each other, feeling free to express their love their compassion, their understanding, as they put aside their differences and co-create a thriving new heart-based or love-based world that works for everyone. A world where we are free to love one another. As our hearts open more and more, together we're activating the natural forces of goodness and love, which are now flowing effortlessly through every living being on earth, expanding the collective heart of humanity, creating a deeper connection with the heart of God, the creator, the central heart that governs the universe and all of life in all forms. Finally, set the intention to continue to radiate this feeling of freedom for the next 28 days or until the next full moon, allowing this inner temple of your heart to remain open, receptive, and available to you at all times. Knowing that this feeling of freedom, that this vibration is what ultimately connects you to all of life and to the beauty of this world. Thank you very much for taking the time to activate the vibration of freedom within your own heart. And do so not only for your own benefit, but for the benefit of others in this world. I look forward to connecting with you again very, very soon. And until then, I send you all of my love. Bye for now.